BPI Sendi S3 is a small-sized Espressif ESP32 S3 development board with a 1.9-inch TFT LCD onboard. The LCD driver chip is ST7789V3, which uses 8-bit parallel interface to communicate with ESP32 S3 main chip. You can find its wiki link below the video with its detailed specs. This board will be equipped with MicroPython firmware and integrate an open-source display driver. Now, let's take a look at how to initialize the screen with Python code. This is Visual Studio Code, or Versus Code for short. I used a high contrast black theme, don't mind it. Create a new folder and open it in Versus Code. Right-click the blank area below the folder and click Open in Integrated Terminal. A terminal window will open, already in the folder path we open. The board can be connected through the MP bridge. Press Enter to get the MicroPython REPL interface. You can view the modules in the firmware by typing this command. ST7789 Display Driver is here. Now, we create a Python script file named tftconfig.py. We will complete the ST7789 pin definition and initialization settings here. In the future, we only need to import this script and use it. Use the shortcut key, Control plus right square brackets, to exit the REPL interface. MP Bridge will automatically sync files to the board immediately. Press Enter again to enter the REPL. Import TFT config. Set rotation equal to 1, it means horizontal display. After typing TFT dot, press the tab key to see all available functions. Initialization is complete. Import the Saint 7789 module. We need to use some of its preset colors. Use the fill function to fill the entire screen with a color. The screen is displayed immediately after using the show function. Now it is showing red. Let's switch to white and see. Then try blue. On and off can switch the backlight. Thanks for watching. The next video on the BPI Sendi S3 will show how to display the picture. Please stay tuned.